what it would uh, apply to is the way you design, run and guide your organisation. A good example of this would be stick to the knitting, focus, focus, focus and increase the efficiency to make more and more money. Terrific. That will kill the organisation. It is absolutely essential in a changing world to allow some diversification, some exploration, to watch what others are doing and to look for threats to your business, not in the traditional directions, but over your shoulder from directions you are not looking. So if you do not guide your organisation to think wider and out of the box that you're already in, the chances are you'll get some nasty surprises. So a couple of examples. Kodak, they died. Hewlett Packard, fantastic amount of damage because what they did was to focus, focus, concentrate, become more and more efficient. One disappeared altogether, one has struggled. Uh, the banks did not see PayPal. Uh, the card companies did not see Bitcoin. For 14 years, Japan and Korea have been paying for things, not with credit cards, you can't actually get one, but by mobile phone. And so this great transition by Apple to be able to make a payment using a mobile phone, one is 14 years old and actually it's pretty slow. Uh, the American system runs at about half a second transaction. The Japanese have been doing the transactions in 150 milliseconds for the last 14 years. So there's lots of things out there that are threats to organizations. Sooner or later, they will get you.